Um, I, yes, I have to say the Dark Urge character is looking very interesting. Um, I think second playthrough, I don't know if it will be streamed, but second playthrough could well be a Dark Urge. I don't know if it would be, like, trying to resist the Dark Urge, because the introduction of the, of the Dark Urge, like the cinematic they've done for it, makes it sound like he's trying to resist. Um, but yeah, no, uh, still first playthrough, we're, we're trying to stick to whatever happens goes. Some things I've had to reload, because I've kind of had to. Um, but I, th I think whatever class you choose, you've got the good and then the evil variant, then you've got other choices, you've got race choices. If you didn't play another game for the rest of your life, there's probably enough in here to to keep you going. Probably. For a long time, for most people, I think. I sold you that. Right, we're done. Yeah, new playthrough, I get you. Main hero is a human bard, and then you've got an evil sorcerer. Dark Urge Monk. Oh, oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Gith Paladin. I would I don't know what the Gith stuff is, because we need to go off and do the Gith Crash. I think it's gonna be next. Do I sell that? It's not really worth it. Um, I think the, the Gith Crash, depending on how that goes without being Gith Yankee, might sway me into doing a Gith Yankee character, but I'm, I'm not planning on it at the minute. I'll be here if you need anything else. But there's just so much that you can do. They, it's such a big game, just for one playthrough so far. My problem is I can't stop thinking about it. Right, let's go get super heavy. Why have I spawned in next to Karlak? I'm not complaining. What's on your mind? I hate that mask. That's what's on my mind. Anybody want to talk? No. Um, Shadowheart, are you? You um, have you changed your hair? And broken your knees. Not gonna... I'm not gonna inquire on that one. Right, okay. Uh, let me op open that. You could spend an, an entire game session just on inventory management, really, couldn't you? Because the inventory management is so full on. Um, can I take? See what? Let's make that bigger. Playing at the same time as a friend. And you're both going about... Yeah. Yeah, like, this week I'm not streaming as much... Well, I am. I'm streaming as much. Pretty much. But I'm streaming less on this channel, and, and we're doing some stuff on the other channel because of the Gamescom. All the news that's hopefully going to come out of there. But what I kind of like about this is me and Mark are, are... Probably by the end of next week, we'll be at similar positions with our playthroughs. Uh, and me and Mark play games very differently. So it, it's if you're enjoying my playthrough, go check out Mark because he gives you that extra way of doing things with his slightly more intelligent but very devout paladin who has never broken his oath once, as far as I'm told. Fairy's never going to get a revenge. Todd's hair is going to be perfectly intact. I think that needs to... Oh, that was going to go on a starion, wasn't it? Right, we have so much crap... Take all of that. 
And all of these. Uh, that that can be sold. Keep Skybreaker. We'll keep the torch. Tripan can go. They can go. That stupid hat can go. No one's going to wear that. What's that? Oh, that was going to go on a Starion. Tough boots can go. Shield can go. That ring can go. And that ring can go. Is that just got rid of... That's just got rid of everything that I was clicking on. Right. Let's try this again. We'll keep that, because that reminds us of our failure. Luminous gloves. When the road deals radiant damage, receive one... Uh, I'm never going to do that. I don't have anybody that would do that. Don't want to be giving people heat either. That's nice. So you can go to where's. You can go to where's. This is keeping you. Keeping you where's. Heavily encumbered is fine. It's it's fine. It's all fine. Keep one of them. Oh, we should probably keep them as well. And keep the drought thing. Uh, send to Lazel. We said we were keeping that. All that can go to Lazel. Keep the Warhammer, because we may need to break through some walls. in there. Oh god. Oh no. Right, so we had a chest of weapons. Uh, why is that not so... We've got a better rapier. Lazel's now heavily encumbered. That's fine. Keep the torches. Send to Will. Send to Will. No, Shadowheart. That's fine. That'll do. What's in here? Books and crap. Come on, game. Do your thing. That one. Oh, we have the Albert. That'll do. That'll do. Let's go sell. So now what? We just wait. Hope the true soul comes through. See any movement out there? Yeah. But isn't that part of D and D? Like the the unwritten rule of D and D is there is elements of inventory management. You're always checking your character sheet for what's in there. Um, what did he think of it? How slow we are. I'm going to sell all this to Damon. Because I like the tiefling. He 
he wasn't there for the first 30 minutes of yeah i can believe it uh i i try and do that stuff off stream like m moving all this stuff around uh increasing the action bars and moving things in i try and do all that off stream before we start but it's kind of impossible when you kill about 50 things and, and have to live sleep. everything so i might as well hammer need anything I'm pretty sure there's better hammering you could do than not even going there. This is an incredibly thirsty game, though. Surely there's someone else he can hammer. Can I just sell wares? He doesn't have a lot of money. What? We were all thinking it. I wasn't selling that. I wasn't selling that either. What has this game done? I was selling them. So we've gone from inventory management to selling said inventory overflow, which is small progress. By that sod, I don't know if it's that good. And I certainly don't want to be dealing necrotic damage in an area where enemies are immune to necrotic damage. It's plus two, though. It's got a nice glow. Although it hasn't there. We're gonna... We've, we're gonna be using other stuff. We're gonna be using speedy reply with that drow longsword that we picked up. So I don't need it. And I'm not gonna give it to anyone else, because I don't want other people to have nice things. Uh, for some. We might actually need to buy that sword. Oh. Six something. Has he got anything else? There was an axe that we saw, wasn't there? It wasn't that. Was it this? Yeah, this. We saw this. Because the shadow soaked blow that did psychic damage every short rest. When the attacker hits an enemy with his weapon, they gain momentum. That's nice. We'll see. Because I'm going to take all of his money here. That'll go to a Starion. Once per long rest, I'm scoring a crit hit with a humanoid. We can, with Todd, we can guarantee a crit. But I'm never going to not use Misty Step because it's so good. That's a quest item. I really want to find the other one of those. Wait, what does Warning Bond do? Oh yeah, plus one ace. Yeah, I see. I need to find the other True Love's Caress. Well, that's thinned, thinned that inventory out a little bit. <laughs> Let's start on the the other horror. Shadowheart. Oh, we had those bombs as well, but they're fire. We had some nice bombs. Um, she doesn't like the moon, does she? She likes darkness. Keep your circle up. Uh, keep the dagger, I gave that to you. Hitting an enemy with this weapon heals the... Oh, but that's the madness thing, isn't it?
Need more of them mask things? Yeah, I agree. Um, right, so you only have a hundred and some. Don't want chainmail too. Oh, ringmail, I hate ringmail. I don't want you to have that. You're already wearing that. That's rare light armor. Stealthy, that could be good for a Starion. Horn blade. That's 400 and some, and that could be good for Todd. That's 204. Right, do that. Do that. Do that. You've got 99. That gives Lazel a, a decent crossbow. Pretty sure all of this can go. Oh my god. This poor guy. He's going to be like, why have you brought all this crap to me? I, I don't want a billion long swords. They're not even magical. Why are you sending me these? Oh, yeah, get rid of that as well. That can go. It can just go. Uh, we have a better rapier. Get rid of that. Damn it, I'm so sorry. I promise I'll buy something in the future. Uh, keep the javelins. No, you have a crossbow. That's not actually moving it across, is it? <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm not selling that. I want... Uh, we've got a Warhammer. Actually, no, I want that pick back. It might come in handy. We might need a pickaxe for paws or something. Don't need all those knives. Don't need a spear. That's not worth anything, so keep that. Uh, right, what sort of business can we do? I guess I'll be having that. Guess I'll be having that. I don't want that, though. Who could use a sword of... I know who could use a sword of life-stealing. Oh, he's got the Psychic Rapier, though. Oh, he doesn't care about that. He's a vampire. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be here if you need anything else. Nice. Done. Sorted. Uh, your inventory is such a mess. Send them to camp. We're still looking like a mess. Why are we so overloaded? I don't, I don't understand it. These potions aren't that heavy. We don't have anything in our bags. We have a bit of alchemy. Um, might be good for you. You can have them as well. It must be this stuff. Wait, you can carry. I am fairly certain. that this game is taking into account all of this and what's in your inventory. Mind you, how heavy are these? They're not that heavy. They're heavy. Odd. 
Very odd. It's very rare that you'll be obscured. I'm going to see what that does. Action, not reaction. Here's me complaining about being overloaded, then I'm just buying weapons and sending them to Todd, because why not? I should have sold that. My faith will guide me. Now you're you're carrying a lot of stuff that you don't need to carry, but I don't know what to do with this armor just yet. That can go to Lazel. Will, did I put anything on you? Okay. Assume nothing. Send that to Will. Well, Sharp as ever. what is going on with your hair, Shadowheart? Ready. Whatever it takes. That helmet is now bugged. Fair enough. The pride of the gate. Time for a chat. Can't sleep, so I might as well hammer. Need anything? We've we've had this conversation before. <laughs> oh, there's so much that you can just sell. I would I would like a couple of really nice scimitars actually. No, keep the torch. Keep that. Keep them. That'll do. Right, I'll we've be here if you need anything else. Cleaned out our inventory on the characters that we're running around with. That's fine. I think we go and do the the Githyanki crash. You have no spells. Uh, you have some spells. You just can't do big heal. But you have that potion. Oh, it gives you back a level 2. That's a level 1, that's a level 2. Good. Well, it is, but it's not very good when you need level 3 spells. Never a dull moment. Is that... Is that in, innuendo, Catherine? Because Todd doesn't swing that way, if that's what you're going for. I, bet they're close. I mean, it... Watching us. Can't help it if the Starion keeps coming on to me, but you're not encumbered, are you? Is there really nothing here? Right, shadowed battlefield. You're cursed. Twice cursed. Right, let's get near the crash. We're going to go and do the crash because we keep finding Githyanki and I want to know what's going on. I want to know what's going on with the Shadowheart's box. I want to push that bit of the story forward before we go into Moonrise. So we're going to try that out. But we're also going to do a long rest before we actually get into anything, because... Not good. Oh, but how do we get there? It's not this way, is it? No. Stop, 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 stop. Move back, move back, move back. Head over here. Guys, come this way. I did. I sold him a hammer. Uh, we have a smiting hammer back home. We have a big war hammer. Pretty sure I sold him. A, we have a, a lump hammer, but I don't think that's going to do him any favors. Does have engraving on it? Nice. Best foot forward. Sharp as ever. 
I thought we sold that. All right, what now? We clearly didn't. Don't waste a step. Uh, this way. This is going to be a fight, isn't it? Don't fall through the level camera. Oh, that's not what I thought it was. I see we go to camp. I say we long rest now and we speak to Helsin. Does anybody want to talk to me? You'll talk to me, won't you, Scratch? Hope you're keeping well, friend. Good boy. Good boy. I'll just love how proud he is when he's petted Scratch. Deals an additional 1d8. A target that still has all their hit points. Or... We can do a shadow attack. That's kind. Of, that's kind of nice. Yeah, okay, we'll run around with that for a while. Really want to be using that again, though. Kalak. Soldier. I'm not taking... Um, but, mm, no, we're doing Lazel. We're getting rid of Lazel. We've done all this. Uh, I guess there isn't anybody to talk to. Lazel. I don't think we've spoken to Lazel that much. Greetings. It was almost nice of you. No. There should be someone there. Where's Withers? The cosy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Sure, you do, you mate. Trade. I bet that milk's gone off. He's been carrying it around for a while. Scroll a gaseous form could be good. Telekinesis. Throw a creature or object up to 18 meters with a thought. Once per turn, you can use telekinesis without expending a spell slot. Ooh. This stuff's expensive, though. Uh, bye. Thaniel is resting. But it's no easy slumber. I discovered what's wrong with him. The shadows rendered him in two when they bore him away to the shadow fell. Half of his essence remained here, amidst the curse. What stayed behind would have been the strongest part of him. But after all these years left in the darkness, corruption must have taken hold. So how do we fix him? Can it be undone? Perhaps. If we can find Thaniel's lost half, and make him whole again. Only the missing half may not come willingly. The curse will have sunk its tendrils deep, twisting Thaniel's essence into something else. I've, now I've got that All Saints song going through my head. Something about making me whole again. They played it when the football was on earlier. And now 
he's reminded me of it and it's going to be stuck in my ear for days you're going to suffer with it too chat it's on you it's not on me it's not my fault it's housings um any ideas on how to find this missing half no matter how it's been twisted by the shadows it is still part of thaniel's essence it will resemble him somehow and may show signs of his power look for the boy signs of life in the darkness yeah. wildflowers where everything else is dead the curse cannot subdue the power thaniel bears not entirely in fact i saw just the sort before not long after we first came within reach of the shadow curse fool that i am i did not grasp their significance at the time there is a ruin some way outside of last light I caught a glimpse of fresh blooms there, but did not investigate further. I shall mark it upon your map. House with flowers. Oh, we can mention it. We don't know if he's dead. I met a shadow child named Oliver, resembling Thaniel, but he's dead now. Perhaps not. If he truly is a part of Thaniel, then he is beyond life and death. More likely, he's just hiding. We should return to where you saw him. And I truly mean we, if you wish. Every moment counts, and I've asked much of you already without being at your side. If you want me, I'm yours. Is he coming on to me? Against the absolute... Anything. Just say the word. Option three. Nothing. Once Thaniel's essence is found, what then? In truth, I'm not sure. This is beyond all reckoning. It's still part of Thaniel deep down, but it may not recognize that, or want to recognize that. Perhaps it can be reasoned with, but I'm not hopeful. Reason is not something that thrives amidst the Shadow Curse. Stay here for now. I'll be ready. 